What's going on guys, my name is CD and today I'm super excited to talk about Modern Warfare because we learned the very first multiplayer information about the next Call of Duty game. So in this video, I'm gonna go over the top five biggest things that we learned today. So if you guys do not already know, today, July 11th, they did a 2v2 multiplayer reveal stream. It was uh, Courage JD, TP, uh, Legion, and Pro Syndicate. And they look like they were actually in the studios kind of testing the game and it looked like a ton of fun. So because of that, we could kind of infer on a lot of information of what the multiplayer is going to look like, but only for this new 2v2 mode. So number one, I want to talk about the new 2v2 game mode gunfight. Now it looked pretty interesting. It kind of reminded me like a 2v2 game battles S and D, but it wasn't search. It was gunfight. I don't know. It's it's 2v2. Once you die, you're out for the round. It's a round based game mode. Um, after the timer is up, there's like an overtime flag in the middle and the first team to cap that wins. Also, if everybody's hiding, the team with the most HP left at the end of the round also won. That was pretty interesting. And because of that, there's no health regen in this mode. Now they made sure to say in this mode, which makes me think that in the normal multiplayer, there will be health regen, or at least I hope there will be. But on the other side of the coin, there is stim shot. And stim shot makes me think that you have to kind of attach that equipment on your class to be able to heal or to be able to heal faster. So we'll have to see how that works out in normal multiplayer. So more on gunfight, every, I believe like two or three rounds, they would just get a random loadout, a random class to play with. And all four players had that same random class. So that was pretty cool because you're not using the exact same class every single round. Everybody's using the same one and you get to use some crazy weapons. They were using shotguns and snipers, deagles, RPGs. I mean, it was pretty fun to watch. Or they did play a few rounds where there was just like random loot scattered around the small map and you were able to go around, loot that, and that was what you had for the round. And the final thing that I kind of noticed about Gunfight was that there was no mini-map. Now my initial thoughts on this is that's only in Gunfight, my thoughts, I don't know this for sure. But because the map is so small and it's 2v2, they didn't feel the need or like the tacticalness for a mini-map. Now I do believe that this will come in the normal multiplayer, I don't see them getting rid of the mini-map, but you never know. The number two biggest thing we could learn from today is that there is leaning or mounting in the game. And you could see this a couple times on their screen when they would get up against a wall, they would aim down sights, and then you could see you could press another button to kind of lean around the corner or mount the gun around the corner. I don't know how this is going to play out. This has been in a previous Call of Duty and it wasn't that big of a deal. A lot of people did not use it. And I just feel like it's not to your advantage to use the leaning mechanic. It kind of took too long. It was a little too clunky. It didn't really flow throughout your gameplay. So we'll see how it works on this they didn't use it too much in the live stream today but i don't know if that's because they're not used to it as well maybe more throughout the game um, as we learn how good it is or how bad it is people will use it or not we'll see number three kill cams are back there's no more like best kill in the round or whatever it was before the final kill cams seem to be back number four there is executions in call of duty modern warfare which is interesting so we did learn that the knifing in this game is just hitting with the gun butt. Uh, that's like the default. So it is a two hit knife, you could say, two hit melee. But if you come up from behind somebody, um, it's not just a one hit kill like it has been in the past. It actually goes into some sort of like execution animation where like the camera moves around and your guy like stabs him in the neck. I don't know if there's multiple of them. We just saw it one time, I believe, in the live stream. My only question is, will it take you out of like the game, feeling like you're in the game on your kill streak? It was pretty quick, like one or two seconds little video little animation i don't think it'll be too bad but we'll see how it plays out and finally number five probably the biggest thing that we learned today is that there's actually different levels of sprint in the game yeah i said that right so it's not just clicking the left stick and your guy sprints i don't know exactly how it works obviously they didn't go into it but you could see it one time courage actually talked about it there was like one level of sprint where he held his gun like at his side and then he went into like another faster level of sprint where he held his gun up Stairs. Chat, look at the sprint. Ready? This is sprint one. He's weak. This He's is sprint weak. two. He's on their steps, on their left steps right now. So I'm not sure how this works if you click the stick once and you start sprinting and you click it like two times and he goes into like a faster, more long distance. You're not expecting someone to be around you 
Uh, sprint, I'm not sure how this works or how this will work. My first thought is it's more of like a rushing strat for search and destroy, um, or if you're trying to get to some sort of flag or objective quickly, you'll do the faster one. It's interesting and it may not be that bad of an idea as it does put you at a disadvantage, but I guess we'll see. All right, so that was the top five biggest things that we learned today from the Modern Warfare reveal, but there are a few other things that I wanna throw in this video. Let's say they're bonus, I don't know. So the first one, there was sliding. So no dolphin diving, if you were wondering, you can kind of slide and there is, kind of, it looked like a little animation for it. And along with that, the running um, seems, now I can't say it feels because I haven't played it yet, but it seems a little clunky. And it kind of reminded me of the type of like sway, you know, when your guy's running, holding the weapon of like Battlefield. And I, I do not like that in Battlefield. So I hope that's not what it feels like in Call of Duty, but it did kind of look like that. Also, when you're aimed down your sights and actually shooting someone down the sights, the guns seem to have a lot more recoil and kick and like a camera shake than I remember in other Call of Duties, which again, reminds me a little bit more of Battlefield. Um, worries me a bit. It didn't look horrible, but it definitely stood out and made me think about it a little bit. Also, the sniper scopes, like aiming down the sight in a sniper. One, you could quick scope. So there was a few quick scope weapons if you're worried. And it reminded me of Call of Duty Ghosts. So if you guys remember aiming down the sights there, it's not just the scope with like black around the side of the screen. You can actually see it's a little blurry, but in the peripherals. And I, I did enjoy that it's a small thing, but I'm gonna like that. And finally, they did announce that the full, I believe full, multiplayer reveal for Modern Warfare will be on August 1st at the same time, 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 a.m. Eastern. Probably a similar stream. I would guess some sort of trailer is what they usually do. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. I hope you guys learned something. If you guys were not able to catch the streams, I'm gonna link the people who were able to stream. I'm gonna link their streams down below. Go check out their VODs. It's about an hour and a half, I think they streamed for. Check out a couple perspectives, you know, see what you guys think. If you guys did enjoy the video, please click that like button down below. Let me know how excited you guys are for Modern Warfare. Modern Warfare. Sub if you guys have not already. Put in the comments down below what you guys thought about the, the stream, about the new multiplayer. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.